You don't okay. make the proof. So before I hand this off, uh, this off to you, I want to talk about Julia because <laughs> I knew you were gonna. I can't not do it. Well, I before know. we start with that, I just want to say, is she, is she a good character by herself? She's very angry. Yes. Okay. Her, well, her deck is one of the most meta ones, and it's a great engine for a lot of things, and it's still used to this day. Oh, goody. Yep. Let's just put it that way. Her deck is good. She's a fun, she's a funny character when you get uh, when you get past her superior her superiority complex and desire oh, to, and desire to murder a couple of people. A couple. She's you with tits. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh. Mm. Better tits. Uh, <laughs> it really comes down to two people, because as far as she knows, and it basically is, her only two targets are Yuto and Shun. Yeah, honestly. But either way, how can you tell them the difference? <laughs> are you trying to say, tell me that, that, that Sonic and Shadow aren't the same person? Wait, what? I didn't say I didn't say you yet. I said Yuto and Shun. I know. And Shun <laughs> is tall. Shun, uh, Shun is tall. Shun's a tall boy. <laughs> Shun is like, they actually had to confirm this outwardly, that uh, that Yuto and all the U-Boys are 14, but Shun is like 17. Yeah, because he has so a... For some, so for some reason, Shun is just, a 17-year-old is randomly just best friends with a 14-year-old. It happens. Which, you know, after Zexel... Not unusual. After Zexel and Kaito being like 19, and Yuma and Shark being like 13, okay, whatever, but... Yeah. That's not really normal in most cases. I mean, I'm like what three years older than you. Yeah, but that's but that's not quite the same thing as Kite being like six years older than Yuma. And I'm dating a woman that's four years younger than I am. Age difference is not an abnormal thing. Yeah. See, I get that though, but it's like in a school setting is where is where it's weird. It's like they wouldn't even be within two schools. Of each well, other. Again, otherwise he's friends. Know. He's friends with with his sister. They can gain a friendship through through that. Yeah, actually, the actually the. Uh, I was like sh- king of the middle schoolers <laughs> when I was uh, in high school. <laughs> <laughs> All shall bow before me. <laughs> Look up. You're, you're, a foot, you're probably a foot taller than everyone. Two feet. <laughs> yes. At any rate, so yeah, sorry we got derailed. <laughs> So Julia's character design, where do I start? That's a lot of yellow. Eyes are fine. I like her eyes. They're, they're pretty cute. Not so much about the mouth, though. <laughs> she's, she's yes, let's start, with, let's, okay, let's start with the mouth. She, ha- uh, she has the typical anime monkey mouth. Uh, the weird uh, zigzag line thing. Yeah. See, see Super Monkey Ball. Yeah. She's got uh, she's got the monkey ears that specifically are designed to, st- uh, to stick in that way out of her hair. Mm. She's uh, she's wearing a yellow thingy underneath that blue overshirt, as in Curious George and the, and the man in the yellow suit. Yeah, her uh, her archetype is uh, her name in English is Julia Crystal. Her archetype is Gem Knight, and her ace monster is Gem Knight uh, Master Diamond. Yeah, this Our char- diamond. <laughs> this character is very clearly is very clearly supposed to be. Supposed to be some sort of African. You can you can tell in the design. If not here, then, defi- then definitely in the anime. What is one of the things that, that Africa or South Africa is, mo- is most is most infamous for? Yeah, <sighs> I know. Lots and lots and lots of blood diamonds. Mm-hmm. How do you do this and not have anyone but me ever notice this? <laughs> so I'm going to also. And because because there's there's one other just sorry real quick there's one other black character in oh. you know, <laughs> I love him hilariously uh, in the Japanese version known by the name of Gallagher <laughs> yes shares my name hilariously in the English version known by known by the immaculate name of Lucas Swank well my name my last name's not good enough for you. <laughs> He needs to be swankier, that's why. <laughs> called, it, called by his title, the Sultan of Swank, <laughs> is literally Kanye West. Yeah. And he's... I, don't, I haven't he's heard... He's also a giant of a man. Yes, he's also very tall. I haven't heard Kanye speak, or even listened to a song of his, in like nine years, but... He Let me has... stop you right there. Let me just stop you right there. <laughs> yeah. God damn it. But uh, <laughs> he has a distinctly... I don't know about rapper, but maybe boss or thug or Don or some kind of black accent. 
and I don't know what to make of that. And he <laughs> runs an underground prison trash facility. How do you do this? So, I'm going to <laughs> say two things straight up. One, I don't I don't think anyone who works at uh, Konami in Japan has ever been outside of their country or knows what anything outside of Japan is. Jinx. Two, I don't think New Yorkers know what A, black people are, or B, Mexicans are. New York. <laughs> yes, New York. Remember that uh, little arc in uh, Something Town? Shit, what was it called? What anime is this? Arc, arc, uh, 5Ds. 5Ds? Oh, with, with the Crash Town. Crash Town. Yeah. Yeah, how they try to do a fake Mexican accent, but I'm like, you know, people don't know what a fucking Mexican is. <laughs> <laughs> I've lived in the Northeast, no Mexicans exist, or the closest you can get is Puerto I Ricans. I was born, I was crafty. <laughs> That's different here, so, because what they're going for there is Gold Rush era California. So, what I think is going on here is you make an absolutely great argument, and I think that. If there was intent behind it, you would absolutely be correct. However, people in Konami are so fucking ignorant of the outside world, I don't think that was intentional. It could have been. <laughs> Someone could have proposed the idea, but I don't immediately think it is correct. I will grant you that possibly for Kanye, but not for Julia. All of the pieces fit too well together yeah. for it not to, at least for Julia. Can you actually show, uh, throw up a picture of Lucas Gallagher Swank? Just so, that, just so that the people know what know what we're talking about. Yeah, because he doesn't show up here. Yeah, no, he's not in this game. I know. When it comes to okay, so I think the whole Gallagher thing. I think that was. I don't think it was so bad in Japan because, like, I know what they're going for. When it comes to the whole black accent thing, New York dubs for kids. They're kind of really bad about driving home stereotypes and just running with it. Partly for creativity purposes and lack thereof. Partly because they go with it. So. That's that's really their fault. Yeah. 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 All right. Here we go. Okay. <laughs> now you have. Now that the conspiracy theory has been uh, written into the sunset, let us continue. Now. I can say I'm probably going to be a lot more chill thereafter. Okay. <laughs> Hopefully. Where are the drinks? Uh, Here's one more. I got right. it. Thank you. Uh, who's? Let me refresh real quickly. Eh, uh, you know what? We're all out. Uh, yeah. Okay. Let me do it while, while you okay. guys do it. I'll aim to... Nah, you're okay. Trust me, the, the, uh, the audio is going to be removing so much of the fan that everything else in the background is going to be dead. <laughs> no worries about that. Alright. That aside, though, I, uh, probable symbolism aside, I think her design is actually pretty okay. The design is good. It's just... It's, a, it's the ears that bother me the most. Yes. The, des the design uh, is good. And Julia is, a, is actually a really fun character. But it's like... When you get past the, all that stuff, she uh, she actually re is a really good, fun, and very powerful character. Shit. But it's like you have to get past that stuff in the first place. I don't like making <laughs> okay. Alright, obviously this is going to be working. This is going to be working right now. I chose a Cyber Dragon Infinity deck, but I don't oh, immediately course. have something good. Oh. Uh, Gemini Fusion, how about uh, Gemini Go Fuck Yourself? How hard? <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> yeah, no, that's how gem knights work. Uh, this game does that a lot too, yeah. I, I know that they also have like some weird like. There's a contact fusion that allows you to uh, fuse with something on your opponent's side of the field. Ah, our diamonds. Something that I, Buster Blair decks can run. I just had another idea that just oh immediately hit me, and I hesitate to say it. Hmm. Sure, I'm bothering to do this. 2014 uh, 15 gems. Black character, Steven Universe. Oh. Uh, That's why I was making a joke that towards, which I be... I've never watched anything of it. I just have friends who are obsessed with it, so I picked up Rather things. Have I. Yeah, I, well, I, of course you haven't. Taylor's really into it, but not as much as she used to be. Um, I can bother about stuff. Ooh! Well, that, that work, actually. Cyber Pair Plant. Uh, let's yeah, all see. three. You can just do both of them. So here's the thing I'm thinking right now. Uh, talk about Light Machine Monster Graveyard. Okay. Pull up. No, I just know what you won't work right now. Regular Cyber Dragon. I wonder if Cyber Dragon Dry, when you bring it to the double, field... Double check its effect first. Before you do anything, make sure yeah. its effect... Normal summon. summon. Fuck. Well, actually, no. Wait, why won't you let me do it? Look in the graveyard. Or look in the deck. Yeah. Uh, you have Norden in here, right? No Norden. 
Uh, this deck doesn't run rank fours. Huh. No, uh, there's a different card. Okay, now I know why inf it, uh, Instant Fusion still has to be in there. It, there's a card that isn't in the game that I thought it was. Oh, that's nice. That's why. And I, I need, and I need to go fix it at some point, and I just never did. It was not one doing it now. Yeah, because it was well, yeah. Hmm. If I had my phone, I could look it up what I was Dude. looking for so we can see if it's even here, but time and effort and yeah. Yeah. Uh, fuck. Well, I can sell the two Cyber Dragons on the field, I guess? You can also fuse. Can I do that? Oh. You contact because you just don't want to. I've anything. actually never... So, you know, this is weird. I've had this deck for months now, but I've actually never borrowed to get Fortress Dragon. Because it's the last thing I need. Mm -hmm. what's, what's this thing need? Don't do that. What? You'll have, you'll, Cyber Dragon will be, will be 100 less weak powerful. Really? Yeah. Oh, be, yeah, I see. Each one. Wait, hold on. Uh, what type is Master Diamond? Rock. They're all rocks. Oh. Makes sense, I guess. Okay. They want to rock and roll. Fuck. Uh... This is bad. Yes. Yeah, this is not going to win. We're going to win. Yeah, fuck it. That was a battle opening hand anyway. Use it. <laughs> that was a battle opening That's hand. That's okay, no, that was the canon ending. <laughs> <laughs> God damn you it. play as the character that loses. You love when games uh, do that. You know, I also am using the deck that you pull the cards from in the, for in the packs. Yes, for some reason Yuzu has Cyber Dragon, Nova, and Infinity. Yeah. Why? No you fucking think, clue. You think it'd be, uh, what's his name? Isn't he actually one of the packs? No. Cyrus huh. is, not Zane. Yes. Okay, it's okay. weird, I know. Hey, there we go. This is much fucking uh, better. Yeah, I'm saying, because what you're, it, hopefully you know, yeah, you should know how to run this. Yeah. I hope so. Do not future fusion. <laughs> do not do that. Why not? <laughs> the first time. Oh. No! Well, okay. That <laughs> only happens... I know you, you learned since then, but I had to bring it okay, back. Okay, <laughs> I know, I know. Okay, that only happened because fucking uh, Cyber Attack Overdragon fucking uh, screwed me over. It blows up everything on the field but itself. But it that does. summons itself. It's so fun, though. But, okay. So I already have one Cyber Dragon in my hand. So I'm going to... What I'm going to do is I'm going to send down both the Cyber Dragons in my deck into the graveyard. Good stuff. Good stuff. That way they're already in there. If I get one more in there, I can use Cyber Attack. Special Summon. Oh, I can also use Monster Report. You don't know. Just yeah. special yeah. something on that one first. I know. Just do the good combo. Just do the good combo. I'm doing over. I'm doing the good combo, don't worry. And just win. <laughs> <laughs> just do the shit and eat his cards. Yeah. Eat all of his fucking cards. Or her, her cards. <laughs> and then you, you overtime. <laughs> you know what actually it may, it makes a whole lot of sense, mm. actually. Actually, it before you uh before you uh, go further, do you wanna make two uh infinity dragons first turn? Sure, what's Use your idea? Use his effect. Use his effect. What's it do? Wait. It does have an effect, doesn't it? I only know what can I think You're welcome. <laughs> once per turn, during your player's turn, you get an advantage once Cyber Dragon from your hand. Uh, the first one. Yeah, you want to yeah. use his first effect. So you get someone to know the Cyber Dragon, <laughs> then you can monster born the other one, that and won't... make two Novas, and then make two Infinities. That... Well... Detachable Actually, material. yeah. If it, it's special summon from the graveyard, yeah. yes. Huh? Okay. Special summon it, then you then yeah. You summon the uh, detach the normal su cyber dragon. Yeah. And then get back cyber dragon. And then you monster uh, reborn another uh, cyber dragon. I get it. And then you want to use the uh, the infinity to absorb the attack position, the one that, that you just use a material for. But that's later, so you're good. Okay. Interesting. I never actually thought about that. I, I forgot that was an, even an option because I always instantly just go and infinity. Yeah, like, same Monster here. Because Monsterborn's a thing, I'm like, oh yeah, wait, we can do things. <laughs> it's same here. I always I see oh, it has the ability. I think there's only one infinity in the deck, sadly. No, oh. there's two. There is two. We have I've, three Novas and two infinities. I've because, used... because we stopped because that was a grinding night. It was. There might and, actually... we did, and we did not bother getting a third. If this deck hasn't been touched since I last used okay, it, yeah, there are right. actually two infinities and two Novas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I think there are three, three Novas. Three Novas. We never bothered grinding for a third infinity because it really was not worth the trouble. It was killing us. Goddamn. It, oh, yeah, here so I am. with that one, absorb before you make the next one so we don't forget. Like, yeah, that's, that's fair. So that way it gains back the one material it lost earlier. Yep. Now you have six negates. In total, oh, but two per fuck. turn. Oh, wait, you can't do it? Oh, yeah, you're right. Shit, I didn't know that. Okay. There you go. I've never actually had the materials to drop one one infinity per turn. This is impressive. Oh, you didn't want you would have done more damage that way. Oh, whatever. Yeah, it it okay. didn't let him. Oh, it didn't. No, it didn't. 
You can only summon one Once infinity per turn. Per turn. Uh, Using that above method anyway. Uh, if you were to do the weird, you know, three, six, level six oh, line yeah, monsters, yeah, still, yeah. you could, but no thank you. Yeah, you're good. Yeah, good. Unless you need to get another Zwei, then you could just like, okay, cool, I'm gonna make a third. Uh, you know, absolute worst case scenario, so we got a Cyber Twin Dragon on the way. Ooh, you bitch. Just, Wait? Yes. yes, because that also fucks up her normal zone for the turn. Yep. Never give her back her monsters. Her monsters are an engine, even in the great. Oh, yeah, no, yeah. definitely. See, that's she, she, she's, that's why I love Infinity, because you just steal them. Yeah, it's only one turn. Yeah, you can make... Yeah, the guy got another eater of machines. I think so. I... And honestly, you could just summon. You could actually just summon um, uh, the little core, and uh, uh, use its effect to get the spell. Get the spell, and then probably use it to activate both effects at the same time. Uh, if we have three in the graveyard, exactly. I think we might actually. I don't no, they're not because because uh, we two have... of them are underneath the second affinity. Yeah. I definitely just got one one. Wait, yes, you have one in there. Ah, yeah, I see. So, yeah, so we can Wait, hold what the hell are you offering me? <laughs> oh, no. Because it counts as Cyber Dragon. Yeah, that's a fair point. Okay, yeah, so, uh, I think we're good here. Yeah. <laughs> so anyway, this, why not? Alright. And game. <laughs> <laughs> just exactly with everything, I want to make sure everything can go. Yeah, no, this is, this is why Infinity is just like, like, was almost banned at one point. I can see why. Yeah, it was, that's why that one exceed, I was telling you how you can turn any deck into, yeah. uh, Infinity. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> Now what should I use? I, I should clearly use a uh, a synchro deck against him. Yes, that would be uh, good. Should I use pink plants? Does it synchro? It does synchro. Sure. It, it can also quasar. <laughs> okay. Show us what you got, man. <laughs> show give, us give what the you got. Give the audience one hell of a show. Uh, I want to go with rock. Oh yeah. my god, you choose. <laughs> I literally yeah. just click X on my god. I, I follow the way of Gong. <laughs> <laughs> Solid as a rock. Uh, ooh. This is a hand. This is new. Uh, interesting. Debris dragon everything. Cherries. Is that BLS in there? Yeah. This is this is an actual deck that quasars and does things. Wow. Okay. Uh, the fuck is that on the right? <laughs> what in the metric Aristotle. fuck? No. You don't get to do anything. <laughs> Chagody was a jump was a jump card, but it was also super good for a while because I can't remember why something was uh, synchroing or whatever. It can it, it can change into any level that you have in the graveyard. On oh, top wow. of that, if if your opponent has a monster and you have the same level in your hand, you can detach you can discard that monster and gain control of it. That actually sounds like Mirror Resonator. I thought you had to dice with it. Nope. That hell just happened. I think about Meteor. Oh. Oh, okay, he's gonna destroy all. Ooh, I'm gonna use my effect. Ooh. Some him. Dragoti is the final villain of the GX manga. Really? Yep. It, it goes above Yubel? Yubel's not a well, then manga. Again, seriously? Manga, yeah. The, uh, I'll put it to you this way. The only manga to follow, uh, the only anime to follow its proper manga story was Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Monsters. Oh, wow. Because it was a manga first. Yeah. Yeah. All the other, all the other ones are actually drawn by... Well, the GX Mog is drawn by a separate guy who honestly probably has the worst art of the lot. Probably. And then, and then 5Ds was also drawn by another guy. And then Zexel and Arc 5 are drawn by uh, by the two guys that actually handle the entirety of the character design team for uh, Arc 5 and Brains. Hmm. I would do that, actually. And, that, and, they are, and the art in the Arc 5 manga looks hmm. fantastic. What you gonna make? Oops. Love air. Not what I meant to do. But... Uh, what do I want to do? Cause I can open up combos for later. I'd probably be careful about those monsters though, because they're all doing ch uh, piercing damage too. Yeah. Well. <sighs> decisions, decisions. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. I, I burned that that, that Regeki way too quickly. <laughs> to be fair, I don't think I did was. What's up? Check what that trap card does. What trap card? The one in his graveyard. Oh, uh, the one. That, uh, sorry, there, meteor rain. Oh, it's, oh, it's that just was it was a trap. Wait, that did that. Me meteor. That's literally just the name of a limit breaker for Final Fantasy VII. Yes, yeah. it is. These guys. <laughs> I I remember because I've watched this duel a couple of times. I remember. I think it was. I think it was Gong, who had a card which the effect was deal da uh, deal damage to both players. 
equal to the level of every of uh, every monster on the field times 300. Wow, okay. And that would have dealt them like 6,000 damage. <laughs> <laughs> just hearing uh, damage according to levels on the field just remind it's not levels but ranks. Uh, fucking Photon ga uh, Prime Dragon. I've been getting so much mileage of that damn thing since you showed it to me. Boop. There we go. Boop. I can fluff tokens. Fluff tokens! Which also got banned. Really? <laughs> yeah. Dandelions got banned because you can make it with tokens. Yeah! Yeah, you, you can totally m make a uh, uh, formula sneak around with it. <laughs> you want junk or a quick draw? <laughs> Just, I, I kind of want to mill. See, yeah. Can I mill a light? Can I mill a light? Ah, oh, I milled another one. Can yeah. we go for three ki for uh, three cannons in a row? Can we get a draw? Actually, if you could pull up a level three, if you have a level three in the graveyard right now, oh, you can Daniel. mix. I have Daniel. I have. You can make Stardust right now. A uh, regular Stardust, not a cor not Quasar. <laughs> I I can do a lot of things right now. Yeah. You can at least uh, get Stardust in the field, so that way you can at least tank the damage or have a wall that you can't really easily go. <gasps> Ooh! Or I can Ooh. just do this. <laughs> fucking nuke his field. Hell yes. Or I can that's, just do this. I love this card so much. I know you no, do. That's, that's why problem. I put it in here. I prefer Spark Dragon over this, personally, but I did this because I know it's you. <laughs> no, that's the problem, Bob. You, you don't want to take the damage. <laughs> See, and then I get two more tokens, which I can discard uh, Sangin or BLS, in my opinion, summon him out. Yes. But I'm going to first do this. Rip. Scarlet's slightly better, though. Because it also does damage and uh, it targets special effect, especially some of the monsters. But this is a really good. Because I can now, can I can now also do this. What you got? Oh, <laughs> good. Word. I've actually never seen that before. I am intrigued. If there were any good ones in the game, you also could have made a rank one. True. At, if I don't think tokens can be used for ranks for yeah. seeds. They can. They might. They can't. You can because you can synchro with them. Unless they, yeah. specify, unless, unless they specify otherwise. You have a token still out there. You can have a look. Bobby, uh, yep. You can exceed with tokens. You should totally invest in Jet Synchron as well, because that thing is pretty decent. Yeah, no, This again, this this deck was made in, like, 2013. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is a deck I, that I literally ripped. There we go. I get his <laughs> he comes back, and... Uh, what do I want back to my hand? Uh... Not even the trag. You can tell how old this deck is just based on the gores. Yeah. I mean, in all You're honesty. You're back all these terrible memories. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> what can I say but you're welcome? <laughs> uh, what gores I... is a bad card. He is. What do I want to But he looks so back? cool, though. What do I want to bring back, though? Uh, Decisions. So a many. Toonie? Well, you have a level 6 in the field right now. Not quite going to do it. I could do... Just bring him back. At this point, I think he just wants to win. A little bit, probably. Oh, Debris Dragon can also bring back something else in the graveyard. Yeah, he can bring back Dandelion again. Jesus Christ. That will allow you to go into Stardust. Yeah, so I can make it again. <coughs> Jesus. <coughs> and I can also do... His effect. What's his effect do? I can remove him from play, discarding this. And then uh, at my next end phase, he gets a uh, he get or at the beginning of my next turn, he comes back and I get to have a card in my, my standby phase. Oh wow! Okay, that's what I did originally. Huh? Boop, boop. And then Dandelion's effect, I get two more tokens. <laughs> God damn! I for, keep for, I always forget you can loop that shit from the graveyard. Yeah. So that's why that's that's what uh, he does. So I keep getting debris dragon back. That's why. Jesus that's why. For, that's why for like two years after Exceed started, Plant Synchro was the most overpowered deck in the game. Yeah, I can see that now. Big yeah. Plants, and I win. No Quasar, but I don't need. Don't really need to when you got low. You did it the once. You've achieved everything we need. Basically, Jesus Christ. 